Imagine that we want to use the BP encoding for Japanese or Chinese, where no explicit space exists between words. So you'd have to implement different pre-tokenizers for such languages. Well, the sentence piece tokenizer tries to solve this issue by treating the input text as a stream of characters, white space included, and it does that by employing the same merging algorithm as in BP or the Unigram tokenizer, which works the other way around and initializes its base vocabulary to a large number of tokens and then progressively trims down each token to obtain a smaller vocabulary until the desired size is achieved. For instance, the resulting tokens after applying the sentence piece tokenizer on the deep learning engineer sentence could look something like this. You can observe that we have an underscore before certain tokens, which is simply a placeholder for the space, which, compared to the BPE or word piece tokenizer, allows us to reconstruct the original sentence by simply concatenating the tokens and replacing the underscore with 